guys welcome back to a software academy javascript tutorial and in this video i'm going to show you that how you can use javascript variable and what is javascript variable so what is javascript variable a variable's purpose is to store information that can be used later remember javascript uh, variable or any other programming variable uh, language variable it is temporary the data stored in variable is a temporary a variable is a symbolic name that represents some data that you see javascript variables can be used to hold values for example x equal to 5 or expression x equal to z equal to x plus y and this is the example where a goes to 30 so if you see here equal so that means actually this is not equal to that's an uh, that is a assignment operator actually so the right side value is assigned in a that means variable a holds value 30. variables names must begin with a letter variable names can also begin with dollar or underscore but will not use it variables names are case sensitive y in a small y and capital y are different variables so for example what do you mean let me show you with example start with script and then script let's declare a variable for a to declare a variable we use where keyword and then 10 then semicolon semicolon is the sentence terminator now let's save it variable dot html now let's show its value document dot right a now let's run the code or file name is variable so you can see it's showing 10 Now, suppose I'm declaring one more variable. First of all, before we proceed ahead, the question arises why it is called variable. It's called variable because its value changes during the program execution. So, what does it mean? I'm, let me show you with example. Suppose I have written here a equals to 10. Okay? Then the value we are displaying, displaying the variable a and the output was 10. Now, once again, in this variable, I am assigning value 20. Now, let's print it and see what is the output. This time, the output will be 20. To put a break, line break, I am write document dot write and then br that means you can insert html code also in your javascript program now same variable is showing 10 and again is showing 20 so what does that mean because its value initially was 10 and when we declare when we assign value 20 in a the previous value is overwritten that means its program its value is varying so variable equal to very class able that means changeable that's why its name is variable now if i want to declare one more value say one more variable actually where v equal to 50. Now let's 
declare third where a where sum equal to a plus b now finally we will show here document dot write sum see the output you can see the output is 70 if I want to put a break then once again I will write here br that means first it will take line break and then this will show this one this plus sign is called concatenation operator so if I want to show like this uh, total is then plus this plus is actually not adding it's joining to uh, you know variable and string the plus sign this plus sign is doing addition adding two numbers but this plus sign is not actually adding two numbers this plus sign is actually joining to um, one string and one variable so hope you understand this in the next video you will see that how use if else